<laughs> I need a dock. Looks like some kind of cloaking technology. Not even the Liberty Navy has ever managed to get those to work. The dig site isn't on any of the charts. We're gonna have to search for it. Let's hope it's still there and that these Rhinelanders didn't find it already. I'm getting a faint signal. It must be the dig site. Hold on. Yes, I think that's it. Looks like they had to excavate inside this rock formation to get to the dig site. Activating landing sequence. This must be the entrance. I'm going in. No lights, no radio contact. This doesn't feel right. Let's hope for the best. Maybe they're all digging for artifacts and don't even know we're coming. Do you think we're too late? We have to find Sinclair and get the hell out of here. And you say you got this where exactly? A thief on Manhattan. He was killed because of it. Now those same people are after us. We were told you could help. Look around you, Miss Zane. You are standing in the living history of the Dom Kavash, a race that predates early man by over 10 million years. Up until recently, relatively speaking, they were the inhabitants of much of our new home here in Sirius. I've been working for years to piece together fragments of their past, their culture, technology, language, anything. These panels here have been the core of my research. They've shed light on some of their writings, but thanks to this piece, I'm close to unlocking their code. Yes, I know quite a lot about this artifact, but not why anyone would want to kill for it. Know anything about cloaking Rhineland ships? Mr. Trent, I am a scientist. I deal in facts, not fiction. Well, you better listen to the facts. A lot of people have died because of this trinket. There's something going on in the colonies. People are being killed. Others have disappeared, like your colleague, Dr. Quintain. Quintain hasn't disappeared. He's a recluse. He's gone under. That's what I think. And a man like him only goes under for a very good reason. I think he knew too much. This is ridiculous. Is it? We find out that Rhineland has an active interest in your research, and when we get here, we're attacked by Rhineland ships using a technology I have never seen before. Still not enough of a connection for you? How about that friends of mine, trusted people in the Liberty military assigned to stop illegal artifact smuggling, are gone, like they were never there? Maybe they knew too much, too. They just didn't see it coming like Quintain. Well, I do, and you should, too. And with him gone, that only leaves you. I figure those ships are coming back here soon, and there's no telling what else they're bringing with them. You, Doctor, can either be a live scientist on the run or a dead one in the ground. Which will it be? I'm not leaving without my work. Besides, how do I know you aren't the enemy? Doctor, we've got over a dozen ships on our screen. I don't know what kind. We didn't see them coming. I told you they were coming back. Pack up what you can and send the others to the ships. Yes, Doctor. Mr. Trent's hold. Good. Get clear while you can. They'll tear this place apart. Come on! Oh my god! Poor guy. Hit him. Oh my god, they destroyed our base, my work! Jesus, they blew up the docking ring. Never mind that. We're outnumbered. We've got to get out of here. Where? Into the nebula. There's a place we can hide. I'm uploading the coordinates. Quickly, people, let's move out.
just a few more seconds. We'll lose them in the nebula. We made it. Hold on. Checking radar. Clear. No sign of them. Doctor, where are we going? Baxter Research Station. It's been abandoned for over a decade, but life support should still be functioning. You weren't joking when you told me about ships appearing out of nowhere. Thank you for getting me out of there. You're welcome. What sort of research station do we have here? This is it. We should land here. Keep your eyes open, they can't be that far off. I think we've managed to shake them for now. I hope you're right. Do you ever get tired of this? The running and fighting? No, this. Tell you the truth, I don't even pay attention anymore. It's a view like this that got me into Xenoarchaeology in the first place. I thought, if the universe exists for eons, but I could only experience it for a brief moment of time. I wondered what a more ancient race must have thought of it. I wanted to live through them. If you're right and Quintain has hidden himself, that means he's still out there somewhere. What's that? They found us! We've got to get out of here! Oh shit. Where? Where are we going? To Leeds. I have a friend there. Come on. Um, we want to hold my little shopping spree real quick. Hope you guys don't mind. Well, even though the station's under attack. Whatever. The station is exploding. We can't outrun them this time. Trent, engage. I don't wanna. Ow. I'm guessing going into Nebula is just like going into the sun or the planet's atmosphere. You just explode. But I'm not really sure I want to find out. Siegfried on not this is I put zigzag in, I wanna hit you. And I'm making this you only making it harder on me. Ow. Last one. Where are you? Where'd you go? There you are. A gunboat? Should be easy. Whoa, whoa! Ow! Hey, 
damage fuel. Ow. I'm sure there'll be more. We have to get to Trent's friend in Leeds. I'm sure the jump gate's being watched. Sinclair, what's your status? Any ideas how to get out of here? I'm okay. There's a jump hole to Cambridge nearby. That's our best shot. From there, it should be easy to get to Leeds. Okay, let's go. So tell me, why did you come here? Surely not just to return the artifact to me. Doctor. Ever since Trent came in possession of the artifact, we've been hunted. First by the Liberty Navy, then bounty hunters, now Rhinelanders. Everybody seems to be after it, and we don't even know what it is. 